three five-minute rounds in the 145-pound division. And when the bell rings, the referee in charge of the action, the third man in the cage will be Dave Ferguson. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, he wears the red trunks with the black trim. At five feet nine inches, he weighed in at 145 pounds. An all-around fighter, making his MMA debut, representing the house MMA. It's fighting out of Win, Arkansas, Jesse Sanderson. the red corner. He wears the black shirts with gamma trails. At 5 feet 11 inches, he weighed in at 145 pounds. A Brazilian jiu-jitsu fighter with a professional MMA record. One win, no losses. Representing the fight shop. And fighting out of Jackson, Tennessee, Red Hot, Ryan! A lot of people here to see both these fighters. Dave Ferguson now will get the two together with the final instructions. Okay, guys, you begin with instructions beforehand. <laughs> Make sure you protect yourself at all times. Listen to everything I have to say. Any questions for the red corner? From the blue corner, touch button, let's fight. Rick, will it be a feeling out process, or are they going to get right into it? No, no feeling out process. Not with these two, not with Ryan, and definitely not with Jesse. Three rounds, five minutes per round at the professional level. Round one. Here we go. They touch gloves. Sanderson right away snaps that kick. Big kick. And then Collins with the overhand right. Collins that time caught Sanderson's attempt at the kick. And out yep. to the ground. Like I said, no feeling out process. <laughs> Sometimes I look at Collins and I, I think he's only 145. Uh -huh. He just seems to be a big. a big 145. He fought Sammy at 135. Remember that? Hard to believe. Oh. Well, Sanderson able to get back to his feet, and he's thrown right back down by Collins. Collins is tough, man. This layoff, I don't see much ring rust right now. Well, you know he's been training hard to get back into the V3 cage. And now, of course, a professional fighter. We know him from those great fights, as you mentioned, as an amateur. But the same deal with Jesse Sanderson and a number of these fighters we've seen tonight. Already a cut, I believe, above Sanderson's right eye. Yeah, I don't even, I can't even remember when that happened. It, I don't think Ryan threw really any big punches. Might have been an accidental headbutt coming together. No, he's bleeding pretty good right now. Dave Ferguson's going to call a timeout. Yeah, he's he, he opened up that cut right there. I think it might have been an accidental headbutt. I'm not sure because I think you're right. I can't remember any blows. But now the physician at cage side Dr. Karuna Dewan will make her way inside the cage to look at Jesse Sanderson. Ryan. Meanwhile, the director of the Tennessee Athletic Commission, Jeff Mullins, also taking a look at the cut. Unfortunately, we don't have the aid of the replay, so we can't actually tell you exactly when it happened, but I think it might have been a headbutt, an accidental headbutt coming together. Now, Rick, explain to our viewers if this cut is too bad and they can't continue. Is it a no contest? Oh, not happy. And that's the way it's going to end. So the cut is, is, is too extensive. That is a monster, though, and it's perfectly right in the eye. And Ryan Collins got off to a great start. I mean, Red Hot jumped all over Sanderson. Are you going to make your way inside? Okay, we're going to see if we can get to the bottom of it. Rick McCracken's going to make his way inside the cage. But this fight will not go on. And I know fans are disappointed, but it's safety first. It always is. Now let's get the official announcement from Michael Kelly, and then Rick McCracken will make his way inside the cage. Ladies and gentlemen, in the B3 days, we present the official time of three minutes and one second into the first round. 
This is due to a doctor stoplight. We declare your winner, Red Hot Ryan Collins. Wow. Okay. So that's what happens. That's what happens. I thought it would be a no contest. It's a W for Ryan Red Hot Collins, who improves to 2-0. and And in his pro debut, Jesse Sanderson. I'm here with the winner, Ryan Collins, man. I'll tell you what, even you were not happy with that. Man, I'm so disappointed. I mean, I, had, I sold 70 tickets, and these guys come and watch. I hate, I hate to run like that. It's horrible. Well, the, the cut was in the worst possible place, right under the, the eyebrow. I mean, yeah, we hit pretty hard. I don't know. I think it may have been a headbutt the week when we come at each other. I don't really know, but... Uh, Dude, we're gonna do it again if Tana set us up. Next, whatever the next show is, cause that, that's, we both train hard and sacrifice a lot of time away from our families and stuff. And I hate that it happened like that. Well, it looked like he was shaping up and it was a real good fight there for a second. Oh yeah, I didn't expect him to. Uh, I didn't. I didn't really expect him to stand up like that. Him throwing the kicks and stuff that threw me off. Cause uh, I, I mean, now now when we get a rematch, I know though. So. All right, man. Anybody you want to thank real quick out here? V three. Uh, all, all, everybody, every single person that came to watch me, really is going to party tonight. And, uh, thanks to Jesse, man. And, uh, hey, like I said, I hate I won like that. Warpath, uh, Ultimate Food. And, uh, I got, uh, Bumpus, I mean, not Bumpus. Uh, Double hey. Circle Four. I got a few other spots. Man. That's hard. I forgot to All right, so where's the party at, man? Uh, 152 and Electric Cowboy. And, uh, wherever I go. There you go. There you go. One more time. Ryan Collins.